Hello everyone. Let's provide the solution to this equation. We have 2 root x plus x equals 8. Now the first thing to be done is to move this to the other side. Mind you, our target is to remove the square root. But we still have 2 root x equals 8 minus x. Now, let's remove these two from here. As we divide both sides by the 2. This will take this away. Now, root x is equal to 8. This right here, we can rewrite it again and get 8 over 2 minus x over 2. So that root x will be equal to 8 over 2 is 4, then minus x over 2. Now, what again can I do? We are going to square both sides now. And the reason for squaring both sides is to is to remove the square root. So on the other side, we have 4 minus x over 2, and this will be squared. This will take this away. And then x will be 4 minus x over 2. Okay, multiply by 4 minus x over 2. So our x now will be 4 times 4, 16. 4 times this, that will be negative 4x over 2. Then minus 4x over 2. That is x over 2 times 4 this negative is coming then this negative will turn to positive x over 2 times x over 2 is x squared over 4 okay so if we go ahead then our x will be 16 minus 2x minus 2x plus x squared over 4 okay now the next thing okay let's work on this middle term we have x equals 16 minus 4x plus x squared over 4 now the next thing i'm going to do is to clear out the fraction so we have 4 times x that will be 4x equals 4 times 16 is 64 minus 4 times um, 4x is 16x then plus 4 will cancel itself from here. We have x squared. You can rearrange this in a better way. So this comes first. We write x squared. This is minus 16x. This becomes minus 4x. And then we have this um, plus 64 equals 0. Let's go over that again. We wrote x squared first. Minus 16x minus 4x then this is plus 64 so our x squared now minus 20x because this and this together is minus 20x plus 64 is equal to zero now the question now is um has led us to a quadratic equation so the next question is how do we solve this very quickly I think it's easy. Two numbers we multiply to get um to get 64 and then we put them together to get minus 20. The numbers will be minus 16 and minus 4. Minus 16 plus minus 4 is minus 20. Minus 16 times minus 4 is positive 64. So that means that the factors now will be x minus 16 and x minus 4 both of them equals 0 now let's look at um, this um, theorem if you have two numbers to multiply that will give you 0 it means that uh, either of them should be equal to 0 so we're going to equate this to 0 first we have x minus 16 right and that is equal to 0 or on the other hand we have x minus 4 and that is equal to 0 so if x 
minus 16 is equal to 0. That means we have x will be equal to 0 plus 16. On the other hand, x will be 0 plus 4. Okay, so if you go ahead, you discover that our x is equal to 16 or x equals 4. Therefore, we have x to be equal to 16 or 4. Now, this is a perfect working, okay, because if you are to solve it, this will be the solution. But then, if you do not verify, you will not be able to know the one that is satisfying and the one that is not satisfying. Because definitely, both of them cannot satisfy the equation. Because the equation given was not originally a quadratic equation. So, it's only one solution that we are to expect. Okay, this is the equation. Now, which of these solutions will satisfy? Let's go and verify. Okay, so we have x to be 16 of 4. Then the equation is 2 root x plus x equals 8. So, we are going to put this value of x into the equation and see if it will give us four i mean eight if you put two um if you put x as 16 then you have that now at the end of the day you will be having square root of 16 is um four two times four is eight so you have eight plus 16 and that gives 24 okay so from here it is understood that x equals 16 does not satisfy the equation so we have to reject that now let's put in the second value remember the equation still remains 2 root x plus x equals 8 now the second value of x is 4 so we put 2 root 4 plus x is still 4 right this will give us 2 times 2 because square root of 4 is 2 then plus 4 2 times 2 is 4 plus 4 and 4 plus 4 is equal to 8 look at the 8 that we had on the right hand side and the 8 that we are having from here so from verification we discover that x equals 16 does not satisfy so it has to be rejected and then our x equals 4 is the only solution to the equation 2 root x plus x equals 8. Thank you for watching and if you have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe so you can get more of my video because this is what we do on this channel. Thank you.